Hey dudes, what's going on? Lush is Seal here, and I am here with something a little bit different. So, I've been uh, thinking about it for a little while, and I've been kind of uh, starting wanting to do the occasional, like, review, or top 10 or 5 list or whatever. So, I thought, you know, may as well start at some point with something. So, what I decided to start with is a review, kind of, on a game called Banished. Now, this game is kind of like a, a bit of an RTS type game, RTS simulated, whatever the fuck it is. I don't know, it's kind of fun. Um, I've only played the one round, one go of it that, you know, of some footage that you're about to see. Here's some stuff. The look at seed, watch seed. I'm gonna put in 6 9. <laughs> okay, now I need to actually name the world. Yeah. Okay, it looks like all these these guys are going in there, in the, in the building. Uh, yep, should build some fucking houses. Better build a road. Right, yeah. Wells are important too, right? Um, build one. Go. I'm just all alone with this deer, and it's really sad. I don't know what I'm doing. So I did like. I don't understand, they like half built houses and just kind of stopped. The other thing is I can't scroll right. What's over here? I don't know. Oh my god, that guy was doing some squat! God, oh my god, lady. Oh my god, there's a fucking deer over there, lady. Lady, lady, watch the fuck out. Oh my god, lady. Oh my god, okay, run, run, lady, run. Yeah, quick, just, just walk away, run, run, get the fuck out of there. Okay, go. Still some half built houses just happening and I don't know why. Then what I decided to do was just let all the citizens do what the fuck they wanted for like, I think it was four minutes I left them and it was at times five speed. And well, basically not much happened. The game sped it up by five times and then I have sped it up again by how many times. I don't really know. They just kind of walked around for a while and didn't a whole lot of not much. And I was just like, come on guys, come on. Then like out of nowhere, I like clicked on some shit and everyone started building. It was weird. I didn't know what was happening. See, look at them, look at them build. Look at them go. Look at them, oh my God, it was ridiculous. Oh my God, now my dog's barking. God damn it. I'm just waiting here. I'm just trying to build this dock and going to do it because I didn't know how to make it build in places. So just going to try and launch to different places, including in the water itself, where it looks like it half builds in the water. Oh, now that I'm thinking about it, after that I played the game, it looks like some of it needs to be on the water and some of it needs to be on the land. But I don't know how to rotate it, so I just kind of was trying places and, and I only tried once to write I don't know, I don't know it was just really hard this game was hard so I just gave up and just given up playing it no I mean giving up it rotate shut up well I guess they should go build the school and the hospital but now that I think the roads are a bit more important so so maybe you should build the roads first guys I know that's what you're doing but maybe you should Maybe you should build the roads first before the hospitals and schools that you need to live. Building roads! Okay, so all those icons about the people mean that they're homeless. And I did tell them to build houses, but then they were like, nah, what we'll do, right, is we'll build roads and then we won't build houses and then complain about being homeless. I then decided to build a chapel so that the people could be super religious. However, I wanted to build it like really far away just to see what would happen, to see if it would make any difference to anything. So I did. And then, I had to build a, you know, a road to it because, you know, you need roads. You need roads, right? Roads are important. And so that's what I did. I built a road to it. It was a really long road because it was really far away. So then the people, right, they decided, you know, we have this chapel, we have this road to build. I know what is most important. Roads. Roads are the most important thing in the world. More important than any building ever. Especially chapels. Oh my god. It's snowing now. 
Oh my god, you're so lucky that we built all these roads, these roads, right? That'll protect us from the snow. Whereas if we built stupid fucking buildings, then we wouldn't have been protected. Is snowing still? Yeah, it's snowing. It's snowing. Better go over here into this rock so I can get these rocks while buying the rocks in a rock. You gotta be a rock to get rocks. Rocks. Right! Then, after a while of, you know, not really knowing what I was doing or anything like that, I just kind of decided again to leave all the citizen people to just do what they wanted. Um, again, at times five speed. And they, all they did was harvest some wood and some rocks and build some roads and then complain about not having shelter. So, yeah. I eventually uh, gave up on them and just let them go at times 10 speed. I just let them uh, hang out in the uh, courtyard area around the well and they didn't get food so they died of starvation and I was like come on guys come on come on overall these guys are a little bit dumb um, the this was this footage that I'm showing is the very first like actual game that I played of Vanished um, so I I just like threw myself into the game just to see what would happen um, and ended up being a lot like oh I don't know what's happening and I don't understand anything or how to do anything um, then towards the end of the game the end of like after everyone died actually one thing I want to point out is when everyone died it wasn't a game over it just kind of kept going it just was like yeah cool you got no one alive but you know the stuff's still here the game's still going you have to quit in order to the game to be over so you should do that maybe so yeah that's what I did uh, but not before looking at a few different settings and discovering that you know I can make people have different jobs because I think what had happened was I made everyone builders however in saying that uh, a lot of them uh, only built roads so they were pretty shit builders they just kind of built some dirt roads and I made them build and that was about it but that's whatever, whatever, ma'am. They can build other ones. They're really good at building dirt roads, I guess. Just not buildings, which is what builders generally do. They build buildings. And then I had some other guys who were on, uh, you know, getting some rocks and uh, getting some wood. But they kind of didn't really do that very much. So that meant that I ran out of resources for the buildings, I guess. So I don't know what happened. But I found a setting in the end that, uh, meant that I could uh, change people's jobs and I kind of didn't realize this until everyone was dead so yes I think if I play it again and I know more what I'm doing then I think it'll be uh, quite a fun game in terms of like games I like to play um, I like to play like RTS type games or like games like this because it reminds me this one especially reminds me a lot of Age of Vampires and I played a lot of Age of Vampires 2 as a kid um, and I had a lot of fun playing it, so I'm probably going to be playing this game again. Anyway, so that is my first review of a game. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you want to see more of these types of videos. Um, I'm thinking, I've been thinking about this for a while. I've um, been wanting to do these. Um, these probably won't happen too often on the channel. Maybe, maybe once a month, maybe a bit more sparse. They're like once every two or three months. Reason being is because as I'm learning whilst making this, it takes a while to actually do everything. So yeah. So that's it from me. Um, hope you guys enjoyed. Remember to stay luscious and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!